E Ninja by Mary Nin. Why the gloomy face? I'm not sure about the about this remote learning stuff. It'll be okay. You're going to figure it out. How are you doing with it? Good. Really? Will you show me how to be successful at it? Sure, I will. The thing about online school is that it's just like going to real school, except we don't leave the house. I'll let you in on a little secret I use to succeed at online school. It's called three P's. I am polite. I am prepared. I am positive. I am prepared. By charging my device the night before, I'll be much happier and not have to worry about missing out on online school. Oh no, I don't have any more battery. If it's going to be, it's up to me. Where's my pencil? Since I don't have a separate room, I sit in my favorite chair at the dining room table. That's where it's quiet in my house and I have a lot of natural light. I have all my classroom supplies ready for use near me. I like staying organized. I'm thirsty. Oh no, I need to use the restroom. I like being ready. That means I get dressed, use the restroom, and eat a hearty meal before class. It may be easy to stay in my pajamas, but I'll be more ready to tackle obstacles if I get dressed as if I were leaving the house. Doing these things help put me in the right mindset. What's wrong with the internet? Mom, I can't log on. I'm always about 10 minutes early to class so that I can test my internet connection, mute my mic, and turn on my camera. I make sure to have my screen on gallery view so I can see all of my friends and teacher. Being punctual, I show respect for my teachers and my classmates' time. Testing, testing, one, two, three. I am polite. I don't know about you, but having my tablet and devices out tempt me to pick them up and play with them so I hide them. Giving my teacher my full attention by eliminating distractions shows respect. Online etiquette. Ears are listening. Ear, eyes are looking. Mouth is quiet. Hands are still. Body is facing the screen. Brain is thinking. Sorry, I can't hear you. I turn off or eliminate any background noise and I sit in a designated workspace during online class. Being polite is kind. Blah, blah, blah. Please wait your turn. When I have a question, I raise my hand and wait until I'm called on or I follow my teacher's guidelines on how to ask questions. Some teachers like it when their students use the questions or chat box while others prefer email. I ask early and I'm not afraid to ask questions, but only when it's my turn. I'm not good on I'm not good at this online school stuff. I am positive. No matter what happens, I try to stay positive. If things go wrong, which they do a lot, I remind myself that I'm trying my best. Things may change often, but if we remain flexible and positive, everything will turn out okay. Positivity is key. Oh. I like keeping a schedule and using checklists to mark items off as I complete them. This helps me to feel like I've achieved something. Checklists and schedules give me a sense of accomplishment. I can't wait to see you succeed at online school. Thanks, friend. Good job, students. Remembering the three Ps could be your secret weapon against online school disaster. Positive, prepared, polite. Advanced learning tips. Remember, 
the 2020 rule created by eye doctors for your eye health. Every 20 minutes, look up for 20 seconds at something 20 feet away. If you know you'll be online for a long time, remember the 202020. Make time for friends even if it means seeing them virtually. Exercising daily will keep you very positive. Revisit your schedule. How did it work for you? Do you need to revise your plan? Self-reflect on the experience learning from a distance. Look in the mirror, smile, say you are proud of yourself and pat yourself on the back. Share your learning with someone at home. Virtual Meeting Success Cheat Sheet. For best results, laminate. Check this off every day. Charge your device, prepare supplies in a quiet workspace, dress properly, eat and use the restroom before class, be punctual, turn on camera and mute mic, Eliminate distractions, turn off TV, radios, move animals to another room, focus and listen, raise your hand and wait your turn, say positive things to yourself, and use checklists and schedules to feel accomplished.